All right, so what is next? Well, we're going to be looking at the new campaign cards that will be coming out. The uh, Destruction Rare cards, DR card lists or whatever. Uh, we're just going to look at them because they just dropped today. Pretty excited for these. It looks like we got a Bojack and a Janimbo card and a Super Saiyan 3 Majin Vegeta. All right, let's check that out. Okay, uh, blah, blah, blah. The series has a new promotional rares that we're calling Destruction Rares. Okay, the agents of Destruction are powerful characters that Bobbity controls with his evil magic. Never knew he controlled Janimbo, but all right. The agents of Destruction will make your make powerful additions to your deck. Make sure to get them all. I will be make sure I get them all. Okay, just looking at the new promo cards here. We got Vegeta, Agent of Destruction, a three cost, two red energy, 20k power here. Um, you know, error special, okay, so not really part of the saga. Auto, when you play this card, choose up to one of your opponent's battle cards with 25,000 power or less and KO it. That's pretty good for a three drop. Activate main once per turn for a cost of one blue energy and one energy ener or any energy. Your leader card is red. Okay, this card gets 10,000 power, double strike, and dual attack for a duration of turn. Whoa, okay, so instantly pan's gonna get better just because it's a red. Leader card is red, that's fine. Uh, you need one blue though, so I guess since beans going to pan's, that's all I'm looking at. And it's available March 8th, 2019. Whoa, okay, so in two weeks. So how do you get these packs? I don't know. All right. And next card we got here, a blue Janimba card, four cost. So you can play it in the um, rel Relentless Speed Janimba, so focus on the middle. Janimba, Agent of Destruction, uh, four cost, two blue. Uh, it's kind of hard to see because this looks all red. Okay, special. Got critical, just like all Janimba. But no deflect. Notice that. No deflect in this one. Auto activate the skill when you play this card from your hand. Or warp. Okay. At the end of the turn, if this card, if it is your turn, at the end of that turn, if it is your turn, okay. Choose up to one of your energy and switch to active mode. All right. And then activate activate main. Send this card to its owner's warp. Draw one card. Then your opponent places three cards from the top of your deck in their drop area. Janemba just got more broken. All right. So Janemba is definitely gonna be top in the next couple of tournaments because you draw one card, and if it stays, if it stays on the field, if you want it to stay on the field, but you know Janemba players are not gonna let it stay on the field, you can switch one energy to active mode. But you draw one card. <laughs> and in place three, that's more than any Janemba card out there. Lord Slug gets more support, and you guys already know I put a Lord Slug uh, video already out there, so I'm already Team Slug right now. Lord Slug, Agent of Destruction, a three cost, two green, loving it already, 20k power. Uh, auto, when you play this card, your opponent chooses one card from the hand and places it in the dropper, still following the synergy of the deck. Activate main, one green, choose up the one Lord Slug's army card from your hand with the original cost of three or less. Other than Lord Slug, Agent of Destruction, and play it. All right, we're going to talk about this for just a second. You don't need Bong. So this is, out of all the Slug Army cards, you don't need Bong. It's a Nam Namekian, right? It's Slug Ar Army, and it's Agent of Destruction as well. So, dang. Okay, when you play this card, your opponent chooses one card from the hand, still following the synergy of the deck. And you can still, do you not, okay, I don't know if you guys play Lord Slug, but if you have the Lord Slug combo, you can actually bring this card. Because it's not safe from your hand when you play this card. So you can play this card from the drop by dropping the big Lord Slug from the drop. And you can <laughs> you can use that green. <laughs> it's just, it's broken. At this point, it's broken. Because, uh, like, once you play that, get this guy, and then use pay one green. Because when you drop the four drop Lord Slug, you can untap one energy uh, just from that. On top of green energy, pick this guy from the drop area, then tap that green energy, and then drop the uh, another Lord Slug or a Slug Army card. I mean, that's just combinations right there. Lord Slug just got better, I'm telling you. Android 13, Agent of Destruction, and some more supports for Android 13. I'm liking that. Uh, critical, activate main for cost of two any any energy. Choose up to one of your opponent's battle cards and KO it. Then your opponent chooses one card from their hand and places it in the drop area. So it does what Chi Lai does, but better because it's not just. Like, uh, if you know how Chi Lai, you need a card to get KO'd, and then your opponent drops one. Well, it just forgetting you KO on it, we're just going to KO ourselves and make you drop one. Got it. Nice. And so these are all three drops, too, which is really good. Uh, Bojack, Agent of Destruction. Auto, when you play this card, choose up the one of your opponent's battle cards, ignoring barrier, and switch it to rest mode. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Activate main two energy. Uh, if this card is in rest mode, rest mode, choose your opponent's leader card and switch it to rest mode, and it can't be switched to... Active mode until the end of your opponent's next turn. So these are all three. That's pretty good too. Oh wow. 
Uh, this card is in rest mode. Choose your opponent's leader card. Switch it to rest mode. It can't be switched to active mode. Whoa, that's the first card that actually targets the leader that uh, from from locking your leader, uh, your opponent's leader down. Hmm. That's pretty good. All right, so all these cards are three costs and then uh, two specific energies, and they're all 20k, uh, 20, 20k power with uh, 5k combo power, and they're all Agent of Destruction plus whatever, Android, uh, Bojack Brigade, uh, Namekian Slug Army, Evil, Evil Incarnate, uh, and Saiyan. Okay, just playing Saiyan there. But yeah, so I know there's another um, card out there. It's not showing it here, but I've seen it. It was a Bobby card somewhere around here. Mm, let me see if I can try to look into... Oh, set six boosters. Okay. Let me try to see if I can try to find it here. I knew I'd seen it, and it's uh, Agent of Destruction as well. I saw it. It didn't have a picture on it at first, but let's see if they uh, put a picture on it now since the Agent of Destruction cards have came out. Mm, getting closer. Okay. Uh, because those cards right there are really good. Really good. They're really gonna, uh, especially Janemba and Lord Slug are really gonna be powerful decks. Pan's definitely gonna be up there. Ooh, nice SPR. Pan's definitely gonna be up there now uh, with that Vegeta. If you're not playing that Vegeta and that Pan, I don't know what you guys are doing. I mean, it's just nasty right there. Um, well, uh, baby, a uh, baby Vegeta is probably gonna be playing that too. Just cause I see some combinations. Okay, I don't see it. Oh, that's weird. Uh, I saw it last time. Uh, maybe I, I skimmed past too fast on it. But, yeah, those cards are really good, and especially the decks are going to be improved. They definitely add a lot of flavor. It's uh, it's kind of like the uh, special promos from um, uh, the booster packs or the power boosters that increase, like, uh, the lineage cards and things like that. Uh, the Path of Greatness, Goku, and everything like that. Okay, I don't see it here, but it was a Bobbity card. Uh, basically, what it did, it decreased all Agent of Destruction cards in your hand by one that way it'd be easier to play so you can actually play them on two drop energy um i do remember uh, having it somewhere uh, i guess i don't if i find a picture on it i just upload it to youtube or something like that or the community channel but yeah those cards are really good uh, i'm just gonna try to go back to them real quickly because uh those <laughs> those are really good cards um and especially if they're gonna be coming out in a couple weeks i'm not too sure exactly how you get them to be honest but uh because I, I didn't hear anything from my local game shop about them or anything like that. But those cards are definitely going to be helping the game out. And those decks, these uh, these five cards here. And like I said, there's a there's a Bobbity card that reduces these by one. That way you can play it as well. But this one's really odd, the Vegeta ones, because you need one blue energy. Um, and then everything else kind of is any energy. But I guess they want you to play it in blue decks, I suppose. But since it is a straight Vegeta deck, you can play it in a Gogeta as well. Uh, or a Vegeta card is a Vegeta character you can play in Gogeta and things like that. So maybe that's what they're pressing for. But yeah, these cards are really good. I mean, if you guys like these cards, please comment uh, uh, down there. Um, and then just kind of say what you like. Which one is your favorite card? I know a lot of people like the Lord Slug. A lot of people is definitely going to like the, or hate the Janimbo, really. Because Janimbo is just going to get powerful with that baby right there. Um, but Android 13 support, that's really good. Uh, no one's played the Bojack because that's set 6. But yeah, I mean, if you guys like it, like the video, please do like and subscribe. Um, definitely comment on which one you guys like the most. If you guys think it's going to help the decks out. If you guys think it's going to make the game even harder or anything like that. Uh, I'm still curious on how you get these cards. But I am, am loving where Bundai is going uh, right now. So thank you guys for watching this video. Um, I will love to see you guys next time. See you guys next time. <laughs>